Now we will discuss about type of internet services but before going to the lesson we have to know about internet service provider. An internet service provider is an organization that provides services for accessing, using or participating in the internet. Internet service providers can be organized in various forms such as commercial, community owned, non-profit or otherwise privately owned. Internet services typically provided by ISPs can include internet access, internet transit, domain name registration, web hosting, usenet service and collocation. An ISP typically serves as the access point or the gateway that provides a user access to everything available on the internet. The following table shows that the top 4 ISPs in India by total subscriber base as of 31st March 2020. The type of internet service we choose will largely depend on which internet service providers that is ISPs serve our area along with the type of services they offer. Here are the some common types of internet services. Dial up. This is generally the slowest type of internet connection and you should probably avoid it unless it is the only service available in your area. Dial-up internet uses your phone line so unless you have multiple phone lines you will not be able to use your landline and the internet at the same time. A speed of 56 kb or less means you have dial-up internet. DSL DSL service uses a broadband connection which makes it much faster than dial-up. DSL connects to the internet via a phone line but does not require you to have a landline at home. And unlike dial-up, you will be able to use the internet and your phone line at the same time. Speeds of up to 100 Mbps are typical DSL cable or fixed wireless. Cable Cable internet connection is a form of broadband access. Through use of a cable modem, users can access the internet over the cable TV lines. Cable modems can provide extremely fast access to the internet. ISDN ISDN that is integrated services digital network allows user to send data voice and video content over digital telephone lines or standard telephone wires the installation of an ISDN adapter is required at both ends of the transmission on the part of the user as well as the internet access provider satellite in certain areas where broadband connection is not yet offered a satellite internet option may be available. Similar to wireless access, satellite connection utilizes a modem. Broadband The high speed internet connection is provided through either cable or telephone companies. One of the fastest options available broadband internet uses multiple data channels to send large quantities of information. The term broadband is shorthand for broad bandwidth. Broadband internet connections such as DSL and cable are considered high bandwidth connections. Although many DSL connections can be considered broadband, not all broadband connections are DSL. Broadband is defined as an always on internet connection with download speed of 512 kbps or above. Mobile hotspots Many cell phone and smartphone providers offer voice plans with internet access. Mobile internet connections provide good speed and allow you to access the internet. Hotspot are sites that offer internet access over a wireless local area network that is WLAN by way of a router that then connects to an internet service provider. Hotspot utilize Wi-Fi technology which allow electronic devices to connect to the internet or exchange data wirelessly through radio waves. Hotspot can be phone based or freestanding, commercial or free to the public. 3G 3G service is the most common used with mobile phones and it connects wirelessly through your ISP's network. However, these type of connections are not always as fast as DSL or cable. Data SMS Mobile Voice introduced in Europe in 2003 based on UTMS that is Universal Mobile Telecommunication System Standards. The maximum download speed of 3G is 42 MB per second while typical download speed is 8 MB per second. 4G 
first launched in December 2009 in Sweden and Norway. 4G networks, also known as LTE, brought all IP services, that is voice and data, a faster broadband internet experiences with unified network architecture and protocols. Apps, more data, faster data access is possible through this. The maximum download speed of 4G is 979 MB per second while typical download speed is 90 MB per second. 5G stands for the fifth generation of mobile communication networks. Data transfer speed will be about 10 times higher with 5G than is possible with 4G. 5G reduces latency making it possible for example to transmit data with no delays or glitches. Cell tower equipped with 5G technology would have greatly increased capacity over 4G or LTE. That means more people and more devices should be able to communicate at the same time. The maximum download speed of 5G is 1 to 10 GB per second, where typical download speed is 150 to 200 MB per second. Now try this. What are the advantages and disadvantages of 1G, 2G, 3G, 4G and 5G technology? Which consumes more battery 2G, 3G or 4G? What are 1G, 2G, 3G, 4G and 5G technologies? What are their differences? What is the difference between dial-up connection and ISDN? What is the difference between broadband and landline? 